This is WNEP's Pennsylvania Outdoor Life. Join us for streamside adventures. Days in the field with new and old friends. It's all about making memories and following traditions. And exciting hunting experiences with interesting people. We've captured the beauty and majesty of the great outdoors. And it's all next on Pennsylvania Outdoor Life. Hello everyone and welcome to Pennsylvania Outdoor Life. I'm Don Jacobs, first weekend of July. Happy 4th of July week, weekend, wherever you're gonna celebrate it. I'm standing in front of the deer for a reason. One week down to the purchasing of your Pennsylvania hunting licenses and the first time ever that they did it online where you can buy your antlerless stove permit. Now I know the first day was a little rough. I went on the second day, boom, got in, no problem. I'm sure it's gonna keep easing up as it goes. But that first day was a little hairy, whether or not you can get on or get one at a Walmart or one of the issuing agents. Now, clear sailing. We'll keep you posted as to when the second and third, if there is such a thing round, are available. But right now we're gonna talk fishing. So we met this couple. They are a couple. They are in business together. They run a very great charity event. And they're a fishing team, Montandon Bassmasters. Janelle Muser and Jason Ryder invited us to fish with them in Sunbury. So we're at the Shikolemi State Park Marina. This is our boat launching facility here locally. Um, and it's where we mostly run most of our tournaments out of or events. So the, this is made by the Faber Dam? Yes, correct. So it creates Lake Augusta when they inflate the dam. Yep. Good luck, guys. Thank you. Thanks. So this is Janelle. Uh, we met 24 years ago. Uh, Shortly, like in a five minute conversation, we realized we both liked to hunt and fish and uh, we had that tradition in our families and we headed off and have been doing this stuff together ever since. I will be starting with a spinnerbait. That's my go-to, but um, so you announced Same. that yeah. we'll be yeah. selling those. Are you make them and sell those we're, as well? Yes, yeah, so this year we're going to start offering our spinnerbaits, yep. So, all I'm really trying to do is stay down below the surface a few inches. Um, I pretty much, we haven't fished for quite a few weeks ourselves. So I'm just looking to see how they react. Uh, if they come up and swat at it or if they actually commit and bite, then I'll just stay at that depth and that speed retrieve. Um, but primarily what I'm doing right now is I'm just probing to see where they're at. There's one. That's a better one. That was a good one. Average size for this section? Or? That's a, a solid, a good solid fish. Um, we've been seeing what we noticed back when they were really spawning. It seems like the average is up compared to some years. And the tournament bags in the past couple years are looking like they're trending up. So, Not only are Jason Ryder and Janelle Muser engaged in tournament fishing partners, they own melting point lures together. So as you were growing up, as you were figuring out what you're doing for a living, did you ever think you'd own a bait company? No, not in a million years. Do you help out? <laughs> Tell me about that. Um, so he's basically the artist when it comes to creating and making the lures. He'll ask my opinion a couple times. Um, however, I do most of the marketing, the advertising, um, the, the Facebook page, the Instagram page. 
and wherever word of mouth I answer a lot of emails and once he taught me how to use a bait caster I've been hooked ever since I don't I'm not huge on finesse I'll use it when I have to but I like power fishing ripping lips that's right <laughs> slinging blades Jason and I used to set a bucket out and we would have our own little competition of who could cast into the bucket. And I couldn't tell you who won. I'm not sure. It helps when you're fishing the edges. I need to use a little heavier head. Oh! oh. <laughs> that was a good one. They just don't like me today. And that's how it goes. Some days he catches them all, some days I catch some. Not all, but... There we go. There you go. Look at that. Look at that. Oh. You got him? Yeah. Need the net? I shouldn't. You have a trailer hook on? No. I'm good. He's just a little guy. Come on. Mm -mm. Of course, right in that meat. There we go. It's a start. Do you see a lot of other women out there? No. Uh, the Thursday night Lunker Leagues, yeah. Uh, pretty much I'm about the only one that typically comes out for the weekend tournaments, the all-day tournaments. There's a couple, um, but I'm about the only one. How did you get started fishing? Um, my dad taking us out trout fishing and my yeah, uncles taking us out trout fishing. So what does it take, what do you look for in a, in a bass tournament partner, is it? You work together? Is it uh, uh, a little bit of camaraderie or is it poking and jabbing at each other? What makes the perfect partner? All the above. All the above. Um, it's if he's throwing one thing, I'm throwing the other. It rarely works that when you're throwing the same thing. Um, different colors, but you're looking for that support. If I'm having a bad day, he's there to pick me up and vice versa. But honestly, when we've done at our best, it's when we have both contributed to the bag that we're weighing in that day. There we go. That's another nice one. The net. Yeah, it's got some good weight to it too. Yeah. For a post spawner. I asked you before, what came first, a fishing lure or romance? It was romance, but <laughs> like I said, it didn't it didn't take us long to know that this is what we were gonna be doing together, and we're both very fortunate. Oh, yes. That a girl. That's a good one. Come up to the front. Stay connected. It feels good. Good enough to hurt the ribs. Yeah. That's a good one. Trying to get him to come around. The boat's not cooperating. He is not. Come on. Ooh, he's a nice one, you know. That's a beautiful fish. Come on. Go. 
don't, 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 don't. No. Nice job. Yay. All right, so that's a tournament winner, I think. That's what you can get when you get, don't get tail ended down all day. Right, <laughs> right, <laughs> yeah. Hey, congratulations. Nice Thanks, spin. guys. Thanks. It's about time. Whew. So what a great day on the water. What a great pair to fish with, laughing, joking, giving each other jabs. I love that kind of camaraderie. We're going to take a short break. When we come back, we're going to figure out exactly what is their allure company all about, and we're going to make some. <laughs>